Hello pilots and ground crew, welcome back to my channel again. Well the weather's been a bit miserable for the last uh, couple of days but uh, a few days ago I got out for a flight, one out long, and I had a problem with my quad. Right? Well what it was, I'd crashed my quad, right? bent the props and stuff, right? it was a bad crash. So I put some brand new pop props on, right? took her for another flight and basically there was a bit of a mess i'll just show you a quick 30 second video right if that 20 seconds and i want you to see right especially new pilots this is right if you're starting to get into this hobby you need to start to figure out how to troubleshoot problems and stuff all right so uh, you'll see there's a problem so just watch this uh, video i don't know why i'm pointing up there i'm going to put it on the screen just going to show you a quick 20 second video and you'll see what the problem is and I want you to see if you can figure out what it is. Alright, here's the video. Okay then pilots and ground crew, there you go. You see that little shake? There was a small little wobble there, you'll see it again. There, that's what's happened after the crash, change the props and all of a sudden she's shaking and wobbling. You can really see it there. When I come back across this field, there you go so there you go you have to figure out why is she shaking why is she wobbling all of a sudden see if you can figure it out right then i'm back so as you could see uh all of a sudden the quad was shaking like mad now before i'll give you a clue here before anyone says your action your hd action camera had come loose right that was just to show you because it was the full quad checking because as I had my goggles on looking through the FPV camera I was getting the same effect it was checking and afterwards I'd landed took off again tried a bit of line of sight and it was still checking line of sight so it's not to do with the action camera so that that's a clue in case somebody says your action cameras come loose in the crash you had earlier so it's nothing to do with the action camera all right so what's the problem all right and I was going to wait until tomorrow to tell you, but I mean, it's only a bit of fun, this video, right? So, pause the video, right? Think about it, right? I'll turn the video off, think about it, come back and watch the rest. So, uh, let's just pause for a second. Right then, we're back. So, did you figure it out or not? Let's find out. And it's a bit of a weird one, alright? Now, I said I'd crashed and I had to change my props. So, my props weren't bent, out like that. There were brand new props on. Now, if anybody said the props weren't balanced because there were new props, they'd be wrong. Alright? But, going through your troubleshooting, you should, right? If you wasn't seeing the same effect through the HD camera and you was only seeing it through your FPV camera, your FPV camera could have come loose. So that's something to check if that ever happens to you, if you've got like a little micro quad or whatever and you're not using a HD action cam. Right? Your camera could have come loose and your camera could be checking. Right? But it wasn't that. And also... Because I'd had a crash, you can actually damage the gyro on your flight control board. Right? But, uh, it, and that means buying a new flight control board. But, luckily, it wasn't that. Also, something else to check, right, is where your mount is, where you've got your flight control board and your VTX and everything. Make sure none of the standoffs, right, have cracked, come loose and wobbling about. Right, so your gyro's all over the place, right? And also make sure nothing, like say you've got the VTX above the flight control board, if the standoffs are split on that, right, they could be banging onto the uh, flight control board and knocking your gyro off to pieces and stuff. But it wasn't that. It was, if anyone guessed, right, well done, I'll have to have a look in the description afterwards, right? But uh, going all the way back to the beginning again, I said I'd had a bad crash and I had to change the props. All right? And this is something you should always check your props first if you're quad checking. All right? That's the very first thing you should do. All right? And I did. I checked all the props. Yeah, they was all nice and straight. They was all still on and all that. 
But then, after checking everything else, I went back to the props. And what had happened was, when I put the new props on, right, prop number two, shall we say, well it is, number two, front right, right, I hadn't tightened the nut down, the locking nut for the prop on the motor completely, and there was a tiny bit of a gap so the prop could move up and down, right? So as I was flying, that prop was moving up and down, which obviously translates all the way through the quad, so it made the quad shake. And as soon as I'd realised that, I tightened that prop nut really tight and locked the prop down, which was flying fan. So anyhow, yeah, there you go, check your props first, which I did as it happens, but I didn't check all the prop nuts nice and tight, but got there in the end. But yeah, this video, ju just a bit of fun, right, and also an educational thing for new pilots and stuff, so if you ever, if your quad ever starts checking, as I said, if it's just happening without an action camera, first thing you want to check is your actual FPV camera that could have come loose, right? Or it could have got damaged in the big crash, right? Check your standoffs, right? Just in case one of them split and your flight control boards all over the bloody place, right? And uh, also check nothing's banging into the flight control board and stuff. And make sure your prop nuts are nice and tight if you change your props. <laughs> Any L pilots and ground crew, just a bit of fun, alright, because uh, the weather's miserable, so I thought, a bit of information, uh, why not? Okay then, uh, thanks for watching, and I uh, might do another one of these in the future. Okay then, uh, cheers.